got a nice deck of cards in the mail. Let's find out what these all are. <laughs> Welcome to a new video. How have you been? I am doing excellent. And I got a nice, nice stuff in the mail, really. I'm very excited to show you all. Let's start off first with, yes, Victini. Tomakazu Kumeya Victini from Leg Legendary Treasures. It's a nice one. It's a reverse holo card. And it's not in terrible condition. It's, it's near mint. There's some widening on there. But of course, you know, these came out of the pack this way. Black and white was uh, notorious for uh, not too uh, m nice of a condition. And uh, this one is actually quite pack fresh. So I'm very happy with it. I'm trying to complete all the reverses, hollows and non hollows in English. And this one I had not yet collected. And these are becoming quite more difficult to get as well. Again, it's a 10 year old set already. Can you imagine? Black and white is 10 years old. Can't wait for the anniversary stuff to happen with black and white, but uh, very happy to have this one collected. Up next are some nice cars as well. Nice. Vaporeon EX. I believe this came in special, yeah, Vaporeon EX decks. And there's a Jolteon and Flareon the EX deck as well. And this is not in the best of condition. It's condition 4, which means it has some uh, form of defect. But to be fair, right, for a card, okay, there's slight damage. It doesn't look too terrible. I have seen way worse cards than this, to be honest. For a thousand yen, I will, I will happily take this. That's a nice throw as well here. I do want to complete uh, these cards in Japanese, so I don't care if it's a little bit damaged. Some uh, nice evolutions. This one is nice. This is, uh, of course, a Naoyo Kimura card. The, the, the style is so distinctive. <laughs> It's a nice card, but uh, I didn't have this one yet in Japanese, and now I do. This is a P2, PT2, this platinum set. What's it called again? Secret Wonders? I have no idea anymore. <laughs> the nice Eevee card. There's no price on there, sadly. More EV, yes, there's a Team Rocket EV. I was surprised I did not have, I didn't, oh, I had this card yet for some reason. I've had uh, plenty in uh, in English, but uh, not uh, this one yet. So I'm glad to have this. This one looks actually quite clean as well. Yeah, the slight indent, unfortunately, but for an old back card. That looks quite nice, to be fair. You won't see the damage or the indent. The pressure mark. But this is a nice card. Here was one that's quite unique. This is the, the Meiji Chocolate promo card of Eevee. And what this is, is these are in English included in the pop series packs. Uh, from the top of my head, I can't remember which series. This one is a kind of exclusive card. And these are com coming be becoming quite difficult to get as well in mint condition. This one also isn't totally mint. You can see some cornerware here, for, for which is very unfortunate. The back doesn't look too aggressively damaged. That looks quite acceptable. Yeah, it's nice. I've seen way worse than this. But yeah, Masakazu, Masakazu Fukuda card. Very nice. Finally got... I w I've been waiting to get a nice example for like since summer. <laughs> Can you imagine? Here's an another one. Nothing too out of the ordinary. 
but it's uh, Auto Genesis EV. I don't think I've got this. I have never opened Auto Genesis before. Um, so this one is still uh, not part of my EV collection. So I'm happy to add that to my collection as well. Looks, yeah, quite cool in the forest. Looking very happy. <laughs> and here's a big one. Yes, I'm loving it. McDonald's Amrion. This one is, uh, I, I believe, the cleanest example now in my collection. There's a, because these, I, I, I want to believe 80% or 70% of out of all of these Amrion cards, McDonald's Amrion, are some, somewhat damaged in some way. But this one, of course, it has its defects, right? Here's a pressure mark, which is unfortunate. Uh, there's some corner wear, very slightly. Where was it? Can't see it right now, but yeah, it's uh, the back doesn't look too terrible. Again, these are 20 year old cards, but they are lovely. Mitsuhiro Arita card, really, really liked this one. Never came in English. It's Japanese exclusive card based off the Aquapolis. Umbreon with the clock tower there. It's very cool. Here's another one. This is Sandstorm Eevee. Don't don't remember the Japanese set name. But I also was missing this in uh, Japanese. Got a bunch of English ones. But not uh, let me compare them. Should be have them here. Where are you? Some of my Eevee spares. Ah, oh, there they are. <laughs> Signs of evolution. Cool, cool, cool card. Up next. Yeah, Raihan. In the spotlights. Wow, this is a cool card. V Star Universe. Yeah, I think this is one is uh, how much how much do do I want to praise Visa Universe, right? I can't get enough of the set. And also you shouldn't for this price. <laughs> I believe I like paid like 800 yen. I mean, it's so so nice. I wish I could uh, get a signature from uh, from Raihan. <laughs> cool, cool card. Here's one that is, in my opinion, massively underrated right now. Yeah, Yu Nagaba. We have to be very careful with this. Don't want to smudge my uh, fingers on this very 40 card. But uh, can you guess the current price for these cards? Let me uh, give you a few seconds and admire this card. How simple it may look. 1600 yen right now. Considering these promo packs are long gone since the summer, yeah, this, this card, uh, to be fair, you know, is the Unigaba set dropped in significantly, also the Umbreon, and that's the most expensive one as well. And this one is more familiar if you are Pokemon League. Yes, Pikachu. This is given out at, uh, I believe, official card shops, but also Pokemon League in English, you can get this. 
and uh, this Dombard same illustrator that won with Charizard, Jiro Sasumo. So it's a very cool touch. Charizard is flipped oh, on his winning artwork. I've got two of them, which is very nice. Of course, more EV right? Yeah, gym promo card. I actually have more amazing EVs coming in the near future. Stay, st watch out for that video in the, uh, because that one will be very nice. But this one is so nice, very flowerful. The English variant is a bit cooler, in my opinion, with the, the Cosmos foil border. But uh, yeah, fine work by uh, Sino Misaki. Okay, you guessed it. More EV. <laughs> Back to my uh, beloved VMAX Climax. I mean, how can you hate on this card? You, you can't. No, if you hate this card, I will hate you. <laughs> it's the most polite threat that I'm giving you. But this is yeah, so awesome. Yeah, come on. I don't have much of these. And I should get more of them. I, I don't know why. Back to Vista Universe. Ah, the, the, this card, I, I, it's just something. The thunder sparks look just so amazing. Let, let me give you a close up. I think it works really well. I think that looks fantastic. It's a nice Vmax card. Zeraora. That is a nice card. Really like this one. Should have gotten it earlier, but hey, Fisto Universe dropped so low that uh, it doesn't hurt me anymore. <laughs> also got um, yeah some of these Umbreons, a couple. I I don't plan to open uh, Rule of the Black Flame anymore. So uh, let's get them while they are still bulk, right? This is this is to me a nice bulk. Can't, you know, how can this go wrong for like 100, 200 yen? And a nice card by uh, Rika as well. Got uh, five of them. Yeah, why not? Here's one uh, that is uh, cool. Unfortunately, it got some uh, slight damage. This is uh, Explosive Birth Lugia. It's from the, the movie. It's from the 10th anniversary Time the Pearl special, whatever collection. It came in a special uh, package. But this one is so, uh, yeah, it's a cool park, cool card, cool pose as well. Mazakazo Fukuda as well, again. A nice swirl there. Doesn't look terrible, but. Uh, then you do this, that hurts. There's some, uh, yeah, needs clean up here as well. Got well loved. There's some smudge that's not, uh, not uh, very nice looking. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, that that happens, right? And uh, final V Max climax card for now yeah this is a uh, fine uh, work by uh, Mitsuhiro Arita I don't have anything to do with Eternatus I do like Rose but also doesn't I don't care about it but then this happened this is just like a uh, a painting it's just that this fine art in my opinion absolutely stunning card and it doesn't cost too much <laughs> that's the crazy part it's like 800 yen or whatever and this is uh, more Komiya stuff unfortunately yeah, from my uh, ancient world pack I didn't pull Brute Bonnet Archer, and uh, so I've bought it. Now up to date again with my Komiya collection. 
It's a very nice card. Now for the final bit. This one is a nice story and I have a friend in Japan that's uh, collecting Crowbat cards, a lot of them. It's a long time collector and uh, we've had a first trade and why uh, I just DM'd uh, him and I said, hey, I have a reverse Crystal Crowbat in German language. Are you interested by any means? He said, of course I am interested. We can trade and uh, yes, so we did. And uh, that person had uh, Lukia cards from his uh, long time collection. And this is so exciting. This is so, this is why trading is so important in this. If you want to collect as well, to give so much more meaning to your collection. It's so nice. Let's start off with best of XY Lugia. Nothing too out of the ordinary. But still a nice card. I won't refuse any look here. And I'm very happy with that. Do miss Tokia again. I believe this is called Bandit Ring XY7. Do your X. SK Yoshino cool card this one is uh, you don't see this one every day anymore I believe this is called World Championships promo 2010 Lugia promo not my favorite I'm going to be honest the 3d hasn't aged well <laughs> but uh, hey, it's still a cool card and I think I think this one uh, almost makes my page complete We'll, we'll check in a bit. But uh, here are some uh, cool bits. The lo this one is it's not from him, but from Ezo Resistance, my older friend. This one was uh, gifted to me. I had no idea this existed. This is a uh, card insert from a black and white era pack. Explaining what Ace pack cards did. B black and white Japanese packs always... Uh, I believe always have a card insert with some advertisements and this is one of them and I'm a happy person I did not know I was very surprised that this existed it's a very cool one now for some nice stuff and in his collection he had this this is uh, cards that he played in his own deck and not one but two Lugia EX I believe it's from uh, Golden Wind, Silvery Ocean, EX and Seaforce in English. I mean, it, it, this is just, this makes me so exciting. And uh, I'll show you a bit why this makes me exciting. This is something that I've been waiting patiently for. This doesn't look terrible as well. Of course, they have their player marks. But... Here's another one. Yes, Neo Genesis Ruya or Neo One. Yeah, you can't beat the original. It's just how it is. Very, very nice. I'm, I'm very happy with this trade. It's just insane. And here's the last one. Yes, Game Boy Ruya. I've made a nice trade, let's be let's be honest, but he also got the trade very well and uh, he really is happy with that and I trade very fairly, right? And it's not about the money, it's not about the money, it's about having fun and so we did, made a nice core connection and uh, I was very happy making a trade and this is why you trade, right? Go social media what you do what you'd love to do to trade make that connection and you will be a happy person i'll come back in a few seconds i'll show my my binder back again with the lugia binder let's uh update my lugia collection let's see where it is
There it is. I'm running out of space, so it seems. Very nice. I need to complete a full page of uh, this one very soon. Here comes the some, in my opinion, important bit. Yes, these two were the final cards for a complete page. And uh, you can tell right now, but I'm very excited. Final piece to the puzzle. And would you look at that? Yeah, this is so nice. F full page. These are World Championships cards, this one as well, but the rest are wheel cards. So I'm very happy with that. Yeah, so nice. Uh, the World Championships promo. Oh, there it is. Oh, wow. Also, a final card. That looks amazing to me. <laughs> yeah, that, lo that looks fantastic. Wow. Right, I think I will end it here. It's 23 minutes in, it's a long video already. What do you think about this meal video? And hope I've uh, learned you something about as well. Like, comment, and subscribe everyone. Have a nice day. Goodbye.